I'm L.K. Elliot. I'm 30 years old, and my biological clock is not ticking. I'm dedicating this video to my homegirls out there whose biological clocks are not ticking. Now, absolutely nothing against mothers because, quite frankly, you may be surprised by this, but I have a mother and I love her. I'm very glad that people out there decided to make babies because otherwise I couldn't possibly be here to discuss this topic with you. However, I just feel like we need a little PSA for the people who don't want to be parents because I don't not want to have kids because I hate kids. I like kids. They're okay in small doses. However, it's not about me hating children. It's about loving myself so damn much that I'm comfortable going against society's pressures and expectations for me and my uterus. I live in a free country and therefore I get to choose what I want to do with my body and my life. I just wanted to make this video to let you know that if you are any age and your biological clock isn't ticking, that's okay. And I know everyone tells me it's going to change. I don't know. I don't see it. I like this lifestyle because I get to do whatever I want. I don't have to adult. I don't really have to wear pants. I definitely don't have to take care of anyone by myself. I like that freedom. I like going to the gym after work. I like going to the gym before work. I like going to ball hockey. I like spending money on things like trips, cameras, and stuff. Not baby stuff. And you know the thing I really, really like about not having kids? Is the fact that I have all this friggin' energy so that when a kid is in the vicinity of LK, that kid is gonna get rocked by me. Because I'm gonna have the energy to go play in that park. I'm gonna give animal rides. I'm gonna be the most fun ever. Because I know that it's not a marathon for me. It's a sprint. I got this short little window of time and I can just give that kid everything I got. And then when I'm burned out and the baby's burned out, we can both go home to our separate homes and have naps. And that, my friend, is a life for me and maybe you. And if it's not for you, that's friggin' awesome too because we need people to make babies too. But I'm just saying, if you're gonna have a baby, do it because you wanna do it. Not because your mom's up your ass or society's up your ass or anyone's up your ass. No one should be up your ass unless you want them to be up your ass and that's okay too. The moral of the story is, Choose a life that makes sense to you. Something that sets your soul on fire. And if that's babies, then make some babies. And if that's not babies, then don't friggin' make them. Give this video a big ol' thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Have an awesome week, you guys. For 10 steps to beat stress and feel your best, check out my book, Confessions of an Ex-Hot Mess. I've also got a free ebook and a guided meditation if you click down below. For last week's video blog, click up here, check it out. And while you're at it, click down here and subscribe.